I'm a little pissed off. Sorry, this is pre-shower. I, you know, I've been having some shoe drama lately. So, Zappos credited my um, credit card back the 220 bucks. So now I can get a pair of shoes from Stacy Adams. This will be the third pair, right? So, after I ordered the shoes, I quickly realized that the other shoes I have, they're cognac. And um, I have a brown belt, but I don't have like a cognac color belt. And I went, I'm going to order the belt, right? So, um, but then I have $8 ship fee for the belt. The shoes, the shipping is free because it's over $75. And I quit trying to get a hold of somebody in customer service to say, can you wipe out the $8 shipping fee and just send the belt in with the shoes, right? Since the shoes are coming free, save me eight bucks, right? Couldn't get a hold of no one. So then this morning I get a hold of someone. She goes, oh, it's already been issued a tracking number. Sorry, there's nothing I can do. I went, fuck, in so many words. I went, fuck you, you've lost a good customer because you could certainly have wiped out that $8 shipping fee, right? After all the money I just spent with you people and the money I've spent over the years, lost a good customer, so fuck you. And then I get another person this morning who goes, oh, you're wrong. It's really this. Right? I don't understand the need for other people to tell other people they're wrong. I don't tell anyone they're wrong. Right? In the back of my head, I'm going, you're a fucking idiot. But I don't say it. Right? Because you can believe your own delusions if you want. Right? But they got to pipe in and go, you're wrong. And then that leads me to somebody else who they made a phone call to me several weeks ago to the cell phone, which I never answer. It's only in the car for an emergency because it don't work here. Right? And they went, oh, Jim, I was in your neck of the woods. I just wanted to stop and say hi. Sorry I missed you. Right? And then I messaged him back on Facebook and says and explained the situation with the cell phone. I said, you know, if you're ever in town, you're always welcome here. And, um, oh, thanks, Jim. Oh, well, wish me luck today because I'm going job hunting. Blah, blah, blah. And I says, oh, well, good luck on the job hunt. Please keep me posted on how it goes. I know you were in this field, but are you still looking for work in that field or something else? I'm genuinely interested, right? And never heard back. Never heard back. Why did you fucking bother with me? Right? Why did you bother? All right. Okay. It's a weird chemtrail kind of day. Right? Just wait until I open a window and breathe it in. But anyway, that's kind of what's pissing me off. Bat. Once this hits water, 